Astronomers just welcomed a fascinating new member to our cosmic neighborhood, a mysterious dwarf planet called 2017 OF201. But this isn't just another icy rock drifting through space. Nope, this little world has caught everyone's attention because of its bizarre orbit, one that could actually help solve one of astronomy's biggest mysteries. So, What's the deal with 2017 OF201? Why is it so special? We're about to find out. But first, do me a favor and smash that like button and hit subscribe so you don't miss any of our space deep dives. All right, here's the scoop. 2017 OF201 is slow, like really slow. This tiny planet takes about 25,000 years to complete just one trip around the sun. That's longer than all of recorded human history. And its orbit? It's anything but ordinary. Instead of a simple circle, it follows a wildly stretched path that swings from just beyond Pluto to an incredible 1,600 times farther from the sun than Earth. This strange, elongated orbit might actually be a crucial clue in the ongoing search for the legendary Planet Nine, the hypothetical Neptune-sized world believed to be lurking in the far reaches of our solar system. The way 2017 OF201 is moving tells us it's not just drifting randomly out there. It's likely being pushed or pulled by something big, something we haven't discovered yet. For most of us, the solar system pretty much ends at Neptune, the eighth planet from the sun. But that's only part of the story. Beyond Neptune lies a massive, mostly unexplored frontier that's full of mystery. First up is the Kuiper Belt, a huge ring of icy worlds and dwarf planets like Pluto, stretching out about 30 times the distance between Earth and the sun. But if you go even farther, you hit the Oort Cloud, an enormous spherical shell that might be where long period comets are born and could even mark the true outer edge of our solar system. Here's a fun fact. The Kuiper belt was just a theory until the 1990s when astronomers finally proved it exists. Since then, we've uncovered only a tiny slice of its secrets. Out there, we've found countless small icy bodies called trans-Neptunian objects. But truth is, we're barely scratching the surface. Over time, astronomers started noticing something really weird. Certain trans-Neptunian objects aren't just scattered randomly out there. They actually cluster together in very specific spots in the Kuiper Belt. It's like something, or someone, is quietly hurting them into place. A lot of scientists think this pattern points to the powerful pull of a massive, hidden planet maybe as big as Neptune, lurking way out past Pluto in the dark. Its gravity could be shaping the orbits of objects like 2017 OF-201, even though we've never actually seen this mysterious world. This idea of Planet Nine is still hotly debated. Some experts say the evidence is pretty convincing, while others think it's too thin to call for a discovery just yet. But here's one thing everyone can agree on. Finding 2017 OF-201 is a total game changer. This exciting discovery was made by a research team led by Sihao Shang at the Institute for Advanced Study in Princeton, and it's pushing the boundaries of what we know about the outer solar system. The team carefully dug through years of data from the dark energy camera on Chile's Blanco telescope. Between 2014 and 2018, they spotted a faint, slow-moving dot of light barely shifting in the sky, but enough to show it was something completely new. That mysterious dot? Now we know it as 2017 OF-201. And it just might be the smoking gun in the hunt for the legendary Planet Nine. But here's the twist. Finding a brand new object on the edge of our solar system was exciting enough. What came next blew the astronomy world away. When scientists first spotted that faint light, they had a gut feeling. This wasn't your typical space rock drifting aimlessly. Its orbit was anything but ordinary. Long, stretched out, and tilted in a way we'd never seen before. Their guess? 
This had to be a massive, never before seen trans-Neptunian object. And they were right. A second set of images, this time from the Canada-France-Hawaii telescope, confirmed its movement and cemented its existence. That's when 2017 OF-201 quietly made its debut on the solar system's map, but with implications that could change everything. Some are calling it Pluto's extraordinary cousin, and this newly spotted world is anything but ordinary. At around 700 kilometers across, it's one of the biggest objects we've found way out in this distant part of the solar system. Only a handful of trans-Neptunian giants are bigger. What's really cool? Its steady brightness and round spherical shape tell us this isn't just some frozen rock. It's a dwarf planet, shaped by its own gravity, just like Pluto, Eris, and Makemake. It's basically a heavyweight champion of the outer solar system. But here's the jaw-dropper, its orbit. When it's farthest from the Sun, this dwarf planet drifts out more than 1,600 astronomical units away. That's 1,600 times farther than Earth. At its closest, it swings in near 44.5 astronomical units, right around Pluto's neighborhood. And get this, it takes a mind-blowing 25,000 years to complete just one orbit. That means we only get a glimpse of it for less than 1% of its entire cosmic journey. Lucky for us, it just happened to be near its closest approach to the Sun and Earth recently. And that's how we caught it. In fact, that moment came in November 1930. Ironically, the exact same year Pluto was discovered. Since then, 2017 off 2000 has been drifting away. And today, it sits about 90.5 astronomical units from Earth, making it one of the most distant objects we've ever seen with visible light. Astronomers think there could be hundreds more of these mysterious worlds, some just as big, maybe even bigger, lurking out in the Kuiper Belt, too distant and faint for our current telescopes to spot. But this discovery isn't just opening a new chapter. It might be slamming a door shut on one old theory, for years, the idea of Planet Nine has been all the buzz. Scientists noticed that certain objects in the Kuiper Belt seem to gather in tight, specific orbits, hinting they're being pulled by the gravity of a massive, hidden planet, maybe the size of Neptune, hiding way out beyond Pluto. These objects' orbits lined up neatly at about 60 degrees, forming a pattern so precise it felt like a cosmic clue. Then along comes 2017 OF-201, and it throws that pattern out the window. Its closest approach to the Sun, or perihelion, is at 306 degrees, completely off track from the others. So what does that mean? Could this be the sign that Planet Nine isn't out there at all? A team led by Sihao Cheng, the same group that helped discover this dwarf planet, ran some serious simulations to test whether Planet Nine could actually be out there. What they found? Pretty shocking. Every time Planet Nine showed up in their models, its gravity messed with 2017 OF-201's orbit, throwing it off balance. Within just 100,000 years, the dwarf planet would get too close to Neptune and eventually get kicked completely out of the solar system. But in the models without Planet Nine, 2017 OF-201 stayed on a chill, stable path for over a billion years. Bottom line? Planet Nine might still be out there somewhere, but the existence of this dwarf planet definitely makes the whole massive hidden planet idea a lot shakier. It's not a knockout proof that Planet Nine doesn't exist, but it sure throws a big shadow of doubt on the theory. But the story isn't over yet. Scientists now think that if Planet Nine is out there, it's probably hiding in a very specific corner of space. And thanks to new data, we're narrowing down that spot more precisely than ever before. And here's where it gets really exciting. Two top astronomers, Mike Brown and Konstantin Batigin from Caltech, took the mystery of Planet Nine into their own hands. They didn't just throw out guesses, they dove deep with complex models, math, 
and some serious curiosity about the unknown. Their goal? To pinpoint the exact orbit that could explain the weird, wonky paths of 11 distant trans-Neptunian objects drifting out past Neptune. And what they discovered completely flipped the game. By factoring in all sorts of influences, not just planetary gravity, but other subtle cosmic forces, they crafted the most detailed map, yet showing where Planet 9 could be lurking in the dark. One possibility paints Planet 9 as a Neptune-like giant, about six times the mass of Earth, cruising along a huge, sweeping orbit with an average distance of 380 astronomical units from the Sun. To put that in perspective, it could swing as close as 300 astronomical units or drift way out to 450 astronomical units. That's mind-blowingly far. But here's the kicker. If Planet 9 is actually smaller, say around 2.2 times Earth's mass, it might sneak in much closer, down to about 85 astronomical units. Still pretty far, but suddenly within reach of our best telescopes. Toss in an orbit tilted about 16 degrees from the main plane of the solar system, and you've got a cosmic mystery that's practically impossible to pin down. So, where's this elusive world right now? If Planet 9 is real, astronomers think it's hanging out near its farthest point from the sun, slow, freezing cold, and hiding in plain sight among a sea of distant stars. Because it's so distant and moves so slowly across the sky, spotting it is like hunting for a tiny needle in a cosmic haystack. But here's the real kicker. What if we've already snapped a photo of Planet 9? If it's bright enough, it could be hiding in old telescope images, just waiting to be uncovered. Pictures taken years ago, sitting in archives, ready for someone with fresh eyes to spot it. Since 2017, astronomers have kicked off a citizen science project, opening up these treasure troves of sky surveys to anyone with an internet connection. That means you could be the one to spot the faint, slow-moving signature of this hidden planet. The next big cosmic discovery might not come from a fancy observatory. It could come from you clicking through images in your pajamas. So, while Planet 9 is still playing hard to get, the chase is very much alive. It's now a race between pros, AI algorithms, and curious stargazers around the world. If you love tagging along on this cosmic mystery, smash that like button and subscribe for more jaw-dropping space discoveries and mind-blowing theories. Catch you in the next video.